Hello and welcome to your new video on this channel. I'm Sabi from Code Revolution. So let me show you today how to use regex to parse specific pages that you import using Crawlomatic and to extract targeted content from them and use them anywhere in your generated post content. So for example, I will extract content today from this TechCrunch article using regex. So I enter it in the scraper star seed URL. And now we have to click settings for the rule that we are creating and for the title query type because I don't want to use the uh, normal title of the post because I thought of I will use better the author name and I will extract the author name using regex and assign it as the post title. So I select here regex first match and now we should hit view, view page source and search for Leslie Hitchcock. So let's search for Hitchcock and here it is. This is the URL in HTML format that we wish to match on each post. And I use the Regexer website to write my Regexes because it will provide a cheat sheet. If you click here on the cheat sheet in the left side of the page, you will have each and every possible regex expression and uh, character sets, anchors, escape characters, and so on that you can use in regexes. So now you can simply paste the content that you wish to match. We will know that this author content will remain the same for each post from techcrunch.com and only the author name will change so we can match this. I like to paste the author name here. I will write the regex now uh, for matching this author and I will explain it after writing it. So bear with me until I write it. Okay, so like this. Okay, this should be right. And here, something similar with this. But here we should have like this. And without this part, I will explain how I wrote this in a minute. So this is the first matching part. If you already know regex, then you will understand how this works. If you don't know regex, let me explain this quickly to you. Uh, however, I strongly encourage you that you check the cheat sheet part of the regexer.com page and try your writing your own regexes because understanding regex from someone else uh, writing like here in the video can be a bit hard. So uh, this means that this uh, character group should not be matched, uh, should not be uh, captured in the plugin. It means that only this uh, character group will be captured and used because we will use only the name, not the URL. So this predecessor of this content means that it is not captured. This means that it can be an, and it can match any character except double quotes and unlimited time. And it will match this character afterwards and another matching group which will match everything except this uh, mark which appears here. And like this, we will match Leslie Hitchcock. I know that this explanation was not uh, newbie friendly, but I, as I said, please go ahead and check regexer.com. You can learn regex very easily here. Okay, so we should go ahead and copy the regex from here and play, paste it here between delimiters. So don't forget the regex delimiters you can use. Uh, hashtags for delimiters in this case. So I pasted the regex I created between hashtags and save settings. And now we will have for this shortcode, the item title, we should have Leslie Hitchcock. 
so to get a better understanding of how we can use this uh, I will write a static content this article was written by and the item title item title will be uh, imported from this regex now let's save settings again to actualize our page and check our blog to see what content it is there already it is empty and let's import the article from TechCrunch refresh the page and it worked this article was written by leslie hitchcock so regex worked it did its job and extracted this part of the article and it will match each and every uh, TechCrunch article and it will place the exact uh, author name in our generated posts okay so this is all don't forget about regexer this is a very very cool website where you can learn regex i learned it also here because uh in the beginning uh of my wordpress development process i did not knew it and i learned it here and i can say i pretty much mastered it because i can match anything using regex now so yeah this is all for this time and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more similar content and go ahead and use regex in Chromatic to extract whatever you want from whichever web page you want from the net and until next time i see you guys have a great day bye bye